Hey guys, and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. If you like what I'm doing, go ahead hit like. If you want to see other games, hit subscribe. We got more to come. Go ahead and comment and ring the notification bell to see when another video comes out. Alright, so we're back here on the Tempest. We're about to head back to Elodin. We just got uh, Spender exiled off the Nexus. Now maybe we can get back to being an actual cohesive group in this cluster. Um, now that Spender's not trying to drive a wedge between the Nexus and the Krogan and other species. Those people are the worst, I swear to God. Everybody trying to like, like separate people by their differences. Right now we're going to focus on trying to find the Turian Ark. Let's do this thing. Okay. We're going to go to Elodin once more. We got a clue where to look. The problem with Elodin is like a huge dust. <laughs> huge dust problem. It gets everywhere. Thanks, Suvi. All right, this time we're taking Ventra. Venture and draw. So, do, do, do. lost but not forgotten. Man, it's way out there. Now I'm going to take the fast travel here. Wild. Yeah. 
Yeah. What's that in the distance? I think it's some wreckage. Looks like there's a bunch of casual. Looks like there's a bunch of scavengers around. Oh, here we go. Oh, you want to get freaky like that? Guys, 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 come. Subject is too old. Not base and barrow. Too many variations in the genome. This one's got power. Now right, let's crack it open. About the pod. Sam, check the pod's history. According to the final log, this stasis pod was jettisoned from Ark Natalis. Maybe when it hit the scourge. The timeline doesn't match. This pod was ejected long after Natalis was reported missing. Then why evacuate? These stasis pods were dumped for a reason. Pick one. Andromeda's nothing but dangerous. We should finish checking the pods for Mason back to Avidus. Tarion, but not their Pathfinder. Subject is a child. Oh, that sucks. Perhaps a distant cousin. No match. None of the pods match Mason Barrow, Pathfinder. Hopefully that means he's still alive. Alright, let's head back to the ship. I think that's it. Alright, Kala, come pick us up. So the Turians jettisoned those pods like long after they arrived here. I think Lexi wants to speak to you. All right, thanks, Ruby. What up, Lexi? It's my night off. Just making the rounds. Just checking. Thought in. you wanted to talk to me. What are you reading? Harry's latest report on Sarah. She's restless, but on the mend. So you're not really taking the night off. 
Work-life balance has never been my strong suit. Just means you're passionate. You love what you do. Nothing wrong with that. Tell that to my exes. How do you do it? Be both you and the Pathfinder. It, it's all just who I am. I don't really think about the Pathfinder thing when it comes to friends, family. The Nomad? Well, there are exceptions to every rule. <laughs> of course. All right, take it easy, Lexi. So, you actually sleep in here? Yeah, see, these are called beds. Most people sleep in them. There you go. Calling me weird again? You're welcome. I do take pride in being weird. What's up, guys? Pathfinder, you have pending vid calls. Abidus. Ryder, I was just about to call you. Everything all right? I've got numbers, coordinates, flashing in my head. I, I think it's an SOS from Mason. It's possible. It could be coming from your salmon plant. He's sending me his location. We did find evidence that Natanus may be intact. What evidence? A bunch of stasis pods were jettisoned from the Ark. No survivors. But the logs show it happened long after Natanus hit the Scourge. Someone's still flying the damn thing. Flying is a strong word. Or keeping it afloat, at least. Here are the coordinates for my implant. Meet me there. We'll find answers. Alright, let's go. The Ramoth system. Uh, we should have hit this place up. Look at these readings. This system is beautiful. I'll say that's a stellar nursery. Stars are born out here. Wow. Approaching the nav point provided by Avatus. Oh my god, there it is. That's the Turian Ark. It's seen better days. Incoming call. <laughs> Pathfinder, I think we're on the right track. No kidding. You think? Is it safe to board? Only one way to find out. I'll meet you inside. Alright, let's do this thing. Life support's busted. Surprised there's any gravity at all. It had a hell of a journey. Looks like it barreled its way through the Scourge by force. HO47C. It was supposed to be the Turian homeworld in Helios. Like Habitat 7. Whoever was piloting the Ark wanted to get here. No matter the cost. Man, they were following the plan. They wanted to find home. It's not really a home if no one's left to live there. Come on. Speculating won't get us anywhere. We're lucky this part of the Ark survived. Looks can be deceiving, Pathfinder. The hull is barely holding together. 
Thanks, Sam. Always a ray of sunshine. I could provide an analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. We got mag boots on. Hey, this door still got power. I wouldn't open that Pathfinder. It leads to space. Perhaps you could divert the power to a different door. To Captain Dia Preton from Mason Barrow, Pathfinder. Attachment, Habitat 5 profile. Full report attached, but our new home's going to put Palvin to shame. Mason. Re HO47C. Mason, what did I tell you about sending me scenes? Ugh. What did I tell you about sending me science crap? Unless it's got charts and pictures, it's all gibberish to me. Dia. P.S. And Ricks. You and Ricks up for drinks after the goodbye party? I've got a special bottle of Horosk. I don't want you... I don't... I did. Sorry, guys. I gotta learn how to read. <laughs> Apparently. Dia. P.S. You and Ricks up for drinks after the goodbye party? I've got a special bottle of Horisk. I don't want just anyone sampling. To Captain Dia. To Captain Dia Parcher from Mason Barrow, Pathfinder. Attachment, Habitat, File, Profile. The helm V2. Now with more charts and pictures. As for drinks, we'll be there. You know how much Abby loves his Horisk. Horosk. Horosk. Mason. Let's do this. Power has been diverted, Pathfinder. Man, it's like a ghost ship out here. Biogenic stability update to Nintana's leadership from Abydos Ricks. Just received confirmation. With the exception of the leadership and life support teams, all passengers have entered cryostasis and are sleeping soundly. Jacinia is on her way up to, you know, to observe. Jacinia? Jacana? I'm wondering if that's a C, well, like an SC or an or CC. What is going on? I can read cryostasis, but I can't read this name. What is wrong? Okay, I'm going to say Jacinia is on her way up to you now to oversee the closure of your pods. If you haven't changed into your uniforms, do so now so that we hit our departure time. Once everyone is asleep, I will do one final round and join you in the abyss. Ricks. Recryogenic stability update. To Abydos Ricks from Captain Dia Preton. No one tried to jump. <laughs> no one tried to jump ship. Don't know if I'm impressed or nervous. Everyone's that confident in the mission. Don't stay up too late, Ricks, or you'll be an old man by the time we reach Helios. Dia. Cryogenic stability update. To Abydos Ricks from Mason Barrow Pathfinder. Avi, Jacinia said it was fine if you oversaw my pod closure. I know I said I wouldn't go against procedure, but I want your face to be the last thing I see in the Milky Way. You can scold me while I enter cryo. See you soon, Mason. Whoa. Yo, Avidus. You and Mason got a, got a thing going on? This one's still got juice. Looks pretty busted. Think your Sam can get us in? Let's give it a shot. Only one way to find out. I found a log from Dea Prater, the Ark's captain. The video is corrupt, but I can recover the audio. Play it. 
Something's tearing the Tannis apart. Half the cryo chamber is gone, trying to get anyone awake to the escape pods. Spirits, there's no time. Find Mason. Hopefully she found him. Maybe she found him. Made it to the escape pods. He wouldn't leave the Ark without me. Natanis didn't get here on its own. We need to know what happened next. The rest of the data on this console is corrupt. Perhaps if we find another. Or the Ark sound note. Alright. Let's keep looking. Oh, how'd we get in here? This one also needs power. Maybe we can use the same trick as last time? Divert power from something else? Well, we need that door. What we don't need is this. The door should now be operational, Pathfinder. Tab node should be down this way. Avidus, over here. There's still life in this one. Sam. Sam. How are we doing? Mason. Bring it back. Something's wrong. The video's corrupted on this one, too. What about audio? Repairing now. One moment, please. It'll be all right, man. We're going to find him, Avidus. Mason, he's more than the Pathfinder to me. Playing audio now. Yeah, Sam, I can tell. How far to Avi's pod? 300 meters. <laughs> An easy stroll, then. Damn it. Maybe not so easy. Where's the rest of it? That is all I could recover. Damn it. He was on his way to you. He was looking for your pod. Do you remember anything before waking up on Havarl? I told you, my first memory was clawing out of my stasis pod. Then we keep looking. That door leads to the SAM node. We've got to get in there. Surprise, it's locked. Here's a console. The sound node should now be accessible. Sam, where's the Pathfinder? Where's Mason? Avi, Avi, Avi. Commence. Stars. Avi, isn't that what Mason called you? He's the only one who calls me that. My counterpart is suffering from severe trauma. If I partition the damage, it may be able to speak with us. Be careful. I don't want to lose this Sam because we rushed for answers. Avitas Riggs, welcome home. Sam, Mason sent coordinates to this location. I need to find him. You are mistaken. I send the coordinates. 
On your own? What do you mean you set the coordinates? The Pathfinder ordered me to help Abitus find a home for the Turians. I located our destination, HO47C, then sought out Avatus. Why would Mason do that? It was his last request. This thing's still busted. It doesn't know what it's talking about. We should have access to Mason's logs. Maybe there's something in there. <laughs> Abby, whatever we hit, a piece of it shredded my suit. Stings like hell, but spirits, it's beautiful. I need you to go on for the both of us. Don't let that temper get the better of you. Sam, commence transfer. Yes, Pathfinder. Even the stars look brighter. He died before the transfer was complete. That must be the source of Sam's trauma. Why bring me here? What was the point? To complete the transfer, the Torians need a Pathfinder. <sighs> I, I can't. Why not? What do you mean you can't? I never thought I'd get the job. My whole career, I worked alone. I don't know how to lead people. I don't want to lead people. Dude, yes you can. You have to. Avatus, I've seen you protect settlers. You found the Turian Ark. You've already been playing the part of Pathfinder. Just without the title. A title that belongs to Mason. Which he wanted you to have. Rejecting it won't bring him back. What if I let him down? You could only do that by walking away. Ah, damn it, you're right. Shall I begin transfer? It'll be safer on the Nexus. Suvi, call Tan. We need a shuttle to pick up the SAM node. Tell him we found the Turian Pathfinder. Jal said he wanted to see you. All right, thanks, Suvi. Well, at least that one didn't, like, end in a fight. I don't know if I'm, like, um, happy or disappointed in that. Alright, now that we got all the arcs, we can go after Meridian. We could do it. We can set up those sensors. Hey, Jaw. <laughs> didn't mean to scare you. What? Uh, I'm, I'm not scared. Uh, one second. What's going on in here? You look busy. If I'm busy, my mind is occupied with whatever I'm working on, uh, rather than worrying. I understand. I can see how that help. Uh, I'd like your advice on something. I'm making gifts for everyone. I have a list. Gifts? Hmm. Do Turians like poetry? For Vetra, I'm writing a poem and engraving it on... Uh, well, uh, I, I'm not sure yet. Oh, I'll take the risk. Who doesn't like a personalized poem? Ah, great. <laughs> Maybe I could just recite it for her. Make sure I'm there for that. Uh, Liam seems to like my Rothgin. I might sew him one. He does. Do Krogan like knives? I could craft a ceremonial and dagger for Drac. You know, he might actually like that, yeah. Who wouldn't want that? It's mainly decorative. Would you like one? Jaw, this is a lot of work. What's really going on? I'm sure that I seem confident and skilled to you. But I'm not. Or I don't feel like I am. You know, I know how you feel. I feel like that a lot. <laughs> Good to know. Yes, thanks for sharing that. Just be yourself. My family is well known. Our lineage is respected. And many of my kin have achieved great things. I've never been one of them. So many older siblings and cousins who succeeded at everything. I stopped trying to keep up. Right. Thanks for listening. Oh, you're part of this team. You're gonna do great things. You're not in anyone's shadow here. I believe in you.
All right, guys, this was super encouraging day. We found the Turian Ark. We got a new Pathfinder, although I am noticing a huge uh, pattern here. None of the original Pathfinders actually like lived long, did they? I just hope the rest of us who take up their, <laughs> you know, job doesn't have like a shorter of a life. Although they seem to have a full one before they made the trip anyway. So I guess the lesson here is uh, stay in your own galaxy if you want to live. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.